Alright, today I'm gonna answer questions gay people have for straight people because I'm gay. I'm gonna see if any of these make sense, but I'm not that good at technology, so I have it on my phone. I'm just gonna answer the questions, okay? Good. I don't feel like editing. I don't edit any of these videos, okay? So, first question. Look at that very original thing. Why is my sexuality a lifestyle? Um, because it's part of your life. It dictates a lot of your life. I don't really like the phrasing lifestyle, lifestyle either, but like, it's true, it's not wrong, whatever. Alright. Okay, and then the next, someone else says like, choosing to wear a dress or something like that. Like, okay, yeah, you don't choose to be gay. But, like, it is part of your life, so it's your lifestyle. Like, if choosing your, to wear a dress is part of your lifestyle, then why isn't, like, being gay a lifestyle? <laughs> Whatever. And also, some guy said, it's not really a lifestyle, it's my life. And I was just like, yeah, that's, that's your lifestyle. All right. Assumed interest. Also, the the question was, why is it that when you find that I, I, why is it that when you find out I'm gay, you assume that I like you? This is a good question, but like I really don't like how Buzzfeed just like to all straight people, because not all straight people do that, and that's like one of my biggest pet peeves in the LGBT community, and so. I mean, I guess it's a problem, and, like, why do people do that? Because I had a friend do that to me once. But of all, like, all the people I've told, it's only happened once. Okay? Once. And it says, everyone has a type. You know, be... You're right. I agree with this question, by the way. Making babies... Also, why are you so worrying how I'm going to have kids? Um, I, I don't know. That's, that's a good question, actually. This is a good question. <laughs> Can you hear my phone vibrating? It's, it's, just, it's just Skylar texting me, okay? Don't worry about it. Okay, someone brought up a point in this, this video. This might not be entertaining at all because I don't feel like letting you watch the video, but it'll have in the description. You, you can watch it if you want. Anyway, so, they're like, technically the world is overpopulated, so... Something like that? I don't know. Um, yeah, I guess, I don't know, I, are you shaming straight people for overpopulating? I don't know. Yeah, you know. Some guy at, like, Game Club was just like, oh, gay people are feelings, but no, they're not. And then he was like, oh, they can't reproduce. Well, first of all, they can. Very carefully. And second of all, overpopulation is a thing. Also, this video quality is really terrible. Like, these, this graininess is really bugging me. It's because it's like, I don't have my watch on today, but it's like, I don't know the time. It's probably around 9.30. Whatever. Who's the man? I tried to show you this. I'm trying to show you this. Um, I've never had someone ask me this. Maybe once. But this question makes no sense. Like, they're both, they're both chicks. They're both dudes. Whatever. That was a really weird way. Um, why would you be offended if someone's like, you're gay? Um, I feel like it's just like the social thing where like, usually people are using gay as an insult, and that's not a good thing, but usually when someone calls someone gay, that's like an insult or something. I don't know. Or maybe they just, you know, don't want other people thinking they're gay because they want to get a girlfriend or a boyfriend or whatever, like, other gender, you know? Yeah. 
Because, like, if I was straight and everyone, someone was going on being like, Oh, Avery's gay. Um, yeah. Um, so yeah, I wouldn't want that because people would think I'm gay and they just, yeah, pretty, pretty obvious now, but whatever. Um, yeah. Representation. So how does it feel to be accurate, rep ac accurately represented in everything? I don't know. I I don't like this. Why is your definition of diversity a gay white man? Um, I don't think that's everyone's definition of diversity, but it is some diversity. It's better than having white, straight people everywhere and if you think Having a woman in a show is diverse. It's not. That's just equality, not diverse. Because 50% of females, 50% of people are female. That's just my opinion. Maybe, maybe I'm totally wrong. And it's diverse if it has a woman. But like, just woman? I don't know. Maybe if it has like, exactly 50% women and men. That's diverse. In like exactly the same percentages. The most that I had was Buffy and she was straight. Okay, I get it. Most of these people didn't have that growing up, but there are a lot of like gay characters and sometimes they're portrayed like well, and sometimes they're not portrayed well, but you know. Straight people be eating each other's faces off. I don't think that's accurate representation. I think accurate representation doesn't worry. Dating pool. Why is it that you have a, such a large dating pool but such a high divorce rate? Um, maybe because they, I, I, I don't know. That's a good question. Maybe he will change. I don't know. This is really like it should be titled Nine Questions Gay People Have for Homophobes. But no, there are straight allies. Also, my hands are purple. I just. Yeah, they're purple. Purple. I just did that in Little Biology Day. Gay weddings. Why do you have to call it a gay wedding? It's just a wedding. Um, because it's gay? I mean, I get your point. It should just be a wedding. But, like, I don't know. I get that point. Like, Okay, okay. Why do you try to set us up with the very next gay person you meet? Um, <sighs> weren't you just complaining about how they had a large dating pool? And are you complaining about how everyone's trying to set you up because you have a smaller dating pool? It makes no sense. But, but, I mean, I don't know. It does make a little bit of sense. But, uh, yeah, I've had people being like, oh, look at this, look at this gay Jesus. <laughs> Whatever. Let me see you up with this will set you up with her, and I'm like, no, that's not how it works. I just kind of, whatever. You can't hear this, but like, all right, that's it. It's been like ten minutes. That's my longest video ever, and you can actually no, I have live streams longer. It's my longest actual video ever, and you can. Look through it. I just burped. Whatever. You can look through it and see. Yeah. Alright. Bye. That was the end of me being cringy. Uh, probably this was very not entertaining at all. And... Yeah.
yeah, yeah, I'll see you whenever I feel like recording a video, which probably won't be for another few months. Because I'm lazy, obviously.